We are back for more playtesting with Kendall. Right. Let's keep testing our burn deck. This looks keepable, if not amazing. I think that that's one of the more terrifying things you can see is a turn one, like, burn to your face. Like, well, I hope that your plane is not uh, can, too worried about that because that's going to be a problem for you otherwise. That's up there with, like, turn one mana elf. Well, uh, I don't know. Just as far as things that scare me. I'm not me. that scared. Of, usually when I see turn one pillar of flame and, and they, at my head, I'm like, oh, my opponent's bad. That's true. I, I've definitely seen that one, that trick before. Thankfully, our hand is looking uh, pretty good this game. Okay. Round and round and round we go. Where we stop, I hope he's at zero. Kind of wish I had more lands that come into play untapped. Also, I hope that my opponent keeps playing Water Greed Graves untapped. Cause... <laughs> Just that one. Yeah, I guess at this point you'd probably start to be a bit hesitant. Do you have a sync pain? Nope. Cool. If you did not, then you probably don't know. Let's see if you took out your unsummons. Or if you have a removal spell at instant speed. I'm leaning toward yes, because otherwise uh, you'd be playing something. I have a removal spell. The problem is that I'm in blue-black, so my removal spells are not very good. Oh. Yes, because black never gets good removal spells. Not in this format. Yeah, Victim of Night's pretty good. Yeah, I mean, yeah, Victim of Night's fine. Um, and... Uh, like, murder's fine, but, like, ultimate price is so awkward. Alright, do you have a uh, counterspell? Uh, maybe. Cool. I.e., show it to me, because you'll have to have two of them. Okay, let's see. Sideboarding. Yes. Delvery things. Let's pull in this because he probably doesn't have much against it, although it's not necessarily what I'd like otherwise. Um, Traitor's Blood would be amazing with his... Uh, Rune Chanter's Pikes, but I'm not sure uh, it's worth doing for just that. So it's kind of between Skull Crack and Thunderbolt for what to take out. Um, uh, Del Delvers, I think that's the cut. And this hand is a beautiful thing. Perfect. 
thankfully we've been getting lucky in that we haven't been seeing a lot of turn one delvers. With a stick, we kind of get to make our opponent stand in Devilver. Okay, that's bad, never mind. <laughs> uh, oh, nice, that's a pretty good, uh, one of our few creatures, uh. Right, so we get to play draw go because we uh, have a lot of instant speed uh, cards in this deck. It's always nice, especially against counter spells. Speaking of counter spells, let's get our, our opponents out of his hand. Let's loot away some of these cards that we cannot play. Um, actually, change in plan. Now we can play those cards, so let's do that. I like looking at what you drop with Fatal Saluting. Uh, like, looting away Searing Spears is probably a good sign. Alright, that's kind of terrifying. Um, kind of wish I'd save the Searing Spear. Um, also, he does not equip, so he's got something good. Um, possibly Syncopate? We shall see. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's what we figured, but it could be worse. Spark Trooper's double white, right? Uh, no, double red. It's double red. Yeah. Go ahead and get this out of the way while he is out of cards. Um, yeah, because I was going to counter your faithless looting. Hey, you never know. <laughs> At least I never know. Well, then I cost six to flashback. But... I figure if you had four syncopates in hand or something, you'd go for it. Okay, so our opponent's got three damage coming at us every turn. We'll have to make sure we can beat that. Okay, what do we think our opponent has? Okay, he's got enough mana up so that he can syncopate for two, so it does not affect whether or not we play Spark Trooper. Um, unfortunately, oh. Spark Spark Trooper will make his white grow, but there's nothing I can do about that right now. Okay, so I'm thinking he doesn't have a counter spell. As a result, I'm going to go ahead and pay mana to get this happening now. Uh, we wanted the land out so that if we draw a land, we win off of a bump in the night. Um, okay, Demir turn. Earlier I was telling Kendall that I don't really like Demir charm just because uh, it's not the sorceries I'm concerned with, but obviously it's working out fine for him this game. It's usually, I mean, it's 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 pretty versatile. Like, there's, it's usually good against something. Either it's good against 
the sorcery or or the killing the little creature or or something. That's fair. Is that um, game? Uh, looks like uh, unless you've got yeah. something. Yeah, it resolves. So yeah, that's game. All right. Uh, thank you for playing. Uh, and that ends that round.